Uh, now, a slightly different game for Josie and John to play. What we're going to do is to get a household object from the studio audience, uh, in the name of one, rather than actually have one given to us. And we'll start off with Josie, and she will sing a song, make up a song on the spot about that household object in a musical style, which will also be provided by the studio audience. Then we'll switch to John. He'll sing about the same object, but in a different musical style, as provided by the studio audience again. So first things first, let's have a, 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 an object, an everyday... Sorry? Ajax. Ajax. We can't advertise. Not with me working for Vim. Uh, what was it? <laughs> what, what was the... Who was that other one? Telephone. There? A, a loo bowl. Telephone. So we're hoping for an English object. Rather than... No, t I'm sorry. No, sorry. It was, tele it was telephone. Yes, I'm sorry. No, no, all right, all right. We only want one object. A telephone is fine. Yes. So uh, Josie's going to start singing about that. But what sort of musical style could you do? Is it like, like? Flamenco. Hang on. So flamenco. That sounds a good one. No, it doesn't sound a good one. So <laughs> sondheim. Is that sort of more of a particular? Sound like sondheim. Sondheim. Yes, you know what that means. <coughs> Can't stand it myself, but there you are. On my own in my home, nowhere to roam, just me and my telephone. What am I gonna do? When will Harry come and see me and marry me? Harry, marry me. Can you hear me sing, Harry? I just want you to ring, Harry. Oh, Well, phone me. Oh, Harry, Mary, can you hear me? I'm a believer, so just pick up your receiver. Very good. Excellent. Excellent. Wow. Well. Huh. Oh, that's about the best bit of Sondheim I've heard for a long while. Now, uh, another musical style for John to sing. Re reggae, reggae, that's all right. There's no, can you, you can do reggae, can't you? Of course you can. So, John, still about a telephone? Oh, still about the telephone. Uh, yeah, yeah. And reggae. Is that reggae? Yes. Yeah, like oh, wait, oh, he has it. With a beep, 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 and a bop, 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 I'm gonna knock on a telephone and I'm on it with you, baby. <laughs> With a beep, 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 I'm not gonna knock, I'm gonna go on the telephone, but not bloody British telecom, mama, in the morning, mama. Gonna dial, 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 make you smile, 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 in the morning, mama, dip, 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 bop, dial, nine, 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 don't want to hear you talk, yeah, on the block. I got you going to beep up, but that's a thing, dong, dong. Round the clock, doesn't have to write any lyrics, because it goes up and down and all over the place. It doesn't matter anyway. Who gives a toss? <laughs> yes, thank you very much, Sean. All right. Very good. <clears throat> very, very good one, especially that last one from John, because it mentioned telephone such a lot, which I particularly like. <laughs> now, we, well, I think... Time. I think I'll give 25 points to Josie and John on that one. I don't know why I'm laughing. Um, next round... <laughs> I'm just getting hysterical. The next round is called The World's Worst, which is rather appropriate, I think, for the stage we've got in the evening. Uh, it's a free-form game, this. And what the uh, people have to imagine... Now, what, what's my note I've got again to do? Oh, yes. The idea is that uh, ITN are looking for a new newscaster or a new newsreader, and they've got to pretend to be the worst people auditioning for that task. So, uh, if you'd like to come forward and stand on that little step and just step forward as you think of them, and I'll just buzz when I've had enough of you, which is a nice, quick, snappy thing. The more you do, the more points you get, the quicker we get going. So, as, whoever's got one, go ahead. A bookie? No, hang on. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wacky! <laughs> so, some, some, some of us are getting a little carried away in the audience now. It? Every other round requires you to yell things out, and you haven't said a word. And now, just at the moment, when we were building up to something very special, I think, from Archie, weren't we? Because the Americans take this sort of long time, long draw to get going, and... Oh, Archie, you've got one. Uh, yes, I'm uh, here to, in uh, to interview for the uh, role of the newscaster. <laughs> Is it... Am I in the right... Uh, excuse me. Und nun die Nachtrichter Engelander! Czechoslovakia, Sturm und Drang! 
This afternoon, a school full school bus, <laughs> school bus. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this afternoon, a school full of but <laughs> bus full of school children, a bus full of school children careened off the road. <laughs> Thirty-seven children were. <laughs> <laughs> what you mean you don't think I'd be very good at the job? <laughs> die, underworld, die. And let the things happen. <laughs> Again, phone <laughs> time. Now give the others a chance, Paul, please. <laughs> 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 This is con... <laughs> <laughs> yes, well... Yes, that's... Well, that's quite enough of those. And while I work out the points for that, uh, we'll switch now to people trying different ways of selling you things. We'll be back after the break. Bye.